I, I, uh, I honestly believe that I was born to fight. I really believe it in my whole heart. You know, and some people think that's silly. Um, but I think a lot of great athletes, people are really good at what they do. Um, it's more than just what they can do in the gym. It's something that starts way before they're known in the arenas. It, it's something that is like an internal belief. And uh, I honestly have convinced myself that I'm not designed to lose. I believe that if I, if I study my opponent, I give these guys the utmost respect and attention they deserve. I don't think that that I was designed to lose to any person. And when you have that level of self-belief, um, it's hard for you to, you know, you just feel like, you feel like you're being disrespectful to your path, to your destiny by allowing your human emotions to take over and showing fear and all that type of stuff. Like, don't get me wrong. I, I, I have the worst anxiety. I get, I get very nervous, but, um, but I, I owe it to myself to not be afraid. And um, I owe it to my beliefs to just fucking get out there and, and do something rare and special. It's, it's a, it's a gift. And um, I really believe it's a gift. I have a lot of hard work, um, but I believe it's a gift. And when you believe that you're gifted outside of just the hard work, then it's just like, bro, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to roll the dice. And so far it's always worked out in my favor. And, and, at this point in my life and career, I don't think it's coincidence anymore. It's something I really believe. I don't think I'm losing a fight. When does that anxiety come in? Is it like backstage or is it during camp? Because honestly, someone as talented as you are, I wouldn't have anticipated you saying you get anxious. I mean, you've been. Oh yeah, I get terrified. Dude, is it? Yeah, I get absolutely terrified. Is it, during camp it usually, it usually, it creeps in when the contract has been signed. Okay. And when I realize, okay, this is really happening, I, I think that's when the the anxiety kicks in. You know, it's just, and and the way I look at anxiety is just, it just means that you care, you care about the outcome and how you perform and how you perceived and everything. Um, I feel like when you when you get to a place when you don't feel anything, it's probably when it's time to hang it up and try something different. Um, at this point, I still get really nervous, man. I have I have nightmares about my opponents. Um, about every hour. Um, Stipe Miocic crossed my mind. Stipe will cross my mind. He will cross my mind. I, I could be having a drink. I could be, you know, I could be, you name it. You know, he crosses my mind. I could be at my kid's volleyball game and, and I'm thinking about Stipe. Um, yeah, there's there's a lot of mental that goes into it that I don't think people realize. Uh, but the, the goal is to just conquer that, conquer that. By the time you get to the arena and you're backstage, you know, you realize that, this is where you were meant to be. Like, this is what you're good at. And, uh, and you owe it to all the people out there who aren't, who are unsure. Like you owe it to them to, to be as excellent as you can be when you find like you found what you're good at.